this was one of those situations where the the storm spun up very quickly, and as, as soon as it as soon as it touched down, it was pretty much gone. Meteorologist for the National Weather Service Chris Darden says storm survey teams found damage off of Parkwood Road near Highway 150 in the Hoover area. He says it appears to be the result of an EF0 tornado with winds up to 75 miles per hour. We describe it as minor damage, but I, I've done enough of these surveys when you know it hits your home, uh, it's not minor, it's, it's significant. He adds other places in Hoover and Bessemer also saw some significant damage with trees falling into homes, which he says could have been dangerous. Overnight it's kind of a scary thing because people are, are mostly sleeping, they're not watching uh, television, and if you have a tree that falls on a uh, manufacture home or goes right to the right part of the house, it, it could be deadly for you. Darden says at this time there hasn't been any reports of injuries, but still he wants to remind families to stay prepared for severe weather. We are kind of in a, we're in an interesting active pattern. I, I could see uh, these type of events continuing as we get into January. So I think it's kind of a wake up call. Maybe, maybe if you don't have your plan in place, if you don't have your weather radio with uh, with fresh batteries, if you don't have your apps on your phone, those sorts of things, just maybe now is the kind of uh, time to start planning for it. In Birmingham, Xavier Harris, WVTM 13.